but muscle training is huge once you get 50 years old, especially. I love the results that you got from AirSculpt. Tell me all about this and what this process was like. Oh my gosh, I am I am just as blown away, just like everybody that has seen my photos. You know, um, I had heard about it. I'd heard about AirSculpt and I looked at their uh, pictures, their before and afters, and I was like, oh my God, these look too good to be true. Mm -hmm. And then I had a girlfriend do it. And I saw her results and I said, you know what, this might be the perfect thing for me because, you know, as women get older, especially during those perimenopausal times, uh, menopause, postmenopause, whatever, we get this like belly fat, abdomen fat that no matter what, I can't get rid of it. It's really hard to target a certain area. I mean, I couldn't fast it away. I was working out like crazy. And I said, you know what, I'm going to do it. I'm going to dive in because this is a permanent solution and i had heard that you know within 48 hours you're back to work you don't go under uh you know anesthesia where you fall asleep it's local anesthesia so you could be awake in fact i was like having a party during my procedure <laughs> i had the music on i was telling all you know the nurses and the doctor i'm inviting you to a party i was having a ball and literally after the procedure i walked on the beach for an hour I had no incisions, I had no bruising, no pain. The, the only thing I felt like is like I did 50 sit-ups or 100 sit-ups the night before. Mm -hmm. That was it. And the results, I'm I'm still every day, even Dottie's like, wow, that is some immediate results. So how much weight did you lose doing this? Or, or was it more of not about the weight, more about like the shaping and the toning? 100% not about the weight. In fact, I don't mm -hmm. even own a scale. Mm -hmm. I, I haven't owned a scale in, in my, in, since my 20s because mm -hmm. muscle weighs more than fat. Mm -hmm. It was about targeting a certain area. You know, I, I literally, I work out two hours a day. You can tell I'm a fit person. But so for me to have this annoying thing when I would sit down or like that my pants wouldn't fit right or, you know, there's a little cheese when I, you know, slouch over. I was like, God for all the work that i'm putting into working out and trying so hard to not have that go away it was really frustrating and taking a toll what do you do on a daily basis to kind of keep in shape and your your your, your health routine i walk 45 minutes to an hour at least you know four days a week i try to do five mm -hmm. um but muscle training is huge once you get 50 years old especially um it, but you you really need, need to keep you know your muscle mass because we lose it as we get older so i do weight training um probably four days a week yeah, yeah. what do you what are your thoughts on this ozempic craze you know what i think whatever suits someone's needs you mm -hmm. know if you fall into the category where you think it's right for you i am not gonna shame you or you know i I'll support anything people want to do. For me in particular, I knew that it was not permanent. Mm -hmm. I knew that a lot of people that go off of it, they regain you know, their weight. And for me, I was like, no, if I'm going to do something and I've done all the work mm -hmm. you know, I could, I've exhausted every other avenue in terms of fitness and um, nutrition, uh, to me, you know, AirSculpt seemed like the best solution. And it's, it still does to me. To, yeah. to have permanently removed makes sense to me.